Hello everybody, and welcome to Star Trek Fun Center. Hello everybody, and welcome to Star Trek Fun Finally, down! Mine's way higher than yours, bro. Okay, you ready? Here it goes. All right, here we go. Chris is all calm, cool, and correct. 99. Ooh, not quite. 98. Oh, geez. yeah. Yes. All right. Oh, I'm coming. I'm, I'm right there, George. All right, here we go. <laughs> Alexia is our lone, bravest recurve shooter. Everybody give it up for Alexia. Christmas camp, and she has been doing fantastic. We've had a group of personal bests. We've had first 300s. We've had first 30X games. We've had even one person, Marcus, may have shot a Swedish junior national record yesterday during qualifications. Unofficial, of course, but the numbers are there. But now we have Leo Riles going against Alexia Graves. Death match number one. So a fun fact about Leo is I understand I got some inside information that at one time he had a blue mohawk, George. Yes, he did. Woo! All right, archers, take your positions. And here we go. The first arrows of Christmas camp. Finals 2018. Alexia, you shoot first. Leo, you shoot second. Looks like it's on the edge of the nine. Where is everybody? Where's your noise? Oh, 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 oh. Did everybody leave? I mean, it got quiet in here all of a sudden. I don't think archery tournament should be quiet. Leo Riles? I think they shoot better when you cheer. Leo going against Alexia. First down. All right, we oh, got a beat. We had a let down. Reset, we got a beat. Reset. reset. I'm gonna help you out here, Leo, so just go and pull it back. I'm gonna give you a break and help you out here. There you go, that Pete looks good. We're dealing with it, here we go. Yes! Someone with binoculars 
Call it out. Leo's got a nine. Alexia has a nine. Alexia has an eight. That's another eight for Alexia. Same exact spot. That's the same exact spot, Alexia. Yeah! Woo! Leo's got one in there. That's the end. It's a nine just on the edge. Leo is scoring the, the small 10. Alexia scores the big 10. Did we manage to get a big 10 target up there for Alexia? All right. So we're going Swedish dot, so it actually doesn't really matter. Oh, Alexia, that's a good one. That's a good one. So once this, once all three arrows are shot, Judge Ronda's gonna go down and check to see who has won this match. What has Leo got? That's a nine. Let's go straight six o'clock. Let's get it for Alexia and Leo. Judge Ronda, go down and check the arrows. Alexia and Leo, go ahead on down there. We're gonna check the arrows. Chris, we're streaming this on your YouTube channel. It's live on my YouTube channel right now. It's epic. People are watching. We're in the hundreds. It's growing. Are we in the hundreds? Already in the hundreds. Are we already yeah, in I've the been hundreds? checking. Yeah. Oh my God, it's great. Right. It's so, been a great start. We had microphones and everything working, and yeah. just as soon as we turn it on, boom, there they Dude, go. Every yeah. time. Every time. I love, are we live? I love it. Are we live? Is are we live? Right. We're on. Right. Yeah. All right. So, yeah. Chris and I and the gang, okay. we've made quite a few uh, podcasts. Yep. Uh, yes. While we were here, and uh, there's a new podcast out. Brand new program, Bro Snap SD. Brand new. We're Stone. Bro we're Stone. 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 Get Stone. Over here. Stone. Where is get it? Over here. Tell us. Tell us about Bro Staff SD. A group of the junior, not junior, but the youth kids of the Hornet Gang, and we all group together. We decided to make something like Junior Code Dog, and we go to tournaments and talk about tips, about how good they shot, and what we can do to make it better. Experience. That is awesome. So stay tuned. Keep your eyes out for Bro Staff SD. SD. Next for sure. Next the next, next generation. And brother against brother. Oh, oh it's oh, getting real now. Brother against brother. Quinn Riles goes against Leo Riles. Yeah. Yes, here we go. Beep, beep. Quinn, hey, you shoot first. Beep. Hey, George, another fun, fun fact about uh, Quinn is he actually trained his dog to find deer antler sheds. I'll vouch for that. Yes. 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 yes, that has actually happened. He has actually taken Pody into the woods, and she has actually found a shed antler. Nice. Winding up for the first shot. Dead oh! Going. Let's go, Leo. Uh, can First someone shot. bring me a whistle so I can make the matches go? Settling in. Never mind. Got a whistle. Oh, oh my God. Right there. Hey, we Quinn, before your next arrow, how do you feel about your last year? Good. Good. <laughs> Just good. <laughs> Nothing else. Yes! Woo! Oh man, this is tough. Things are rolling. This is gonna get interesting. Quinn is 12, Leo is 10. Hey Leo, before you shoot that, <laughs> <laughs> have you had a lot of fun this week? Yeah, that's been great. I've seen the short draw crew, because you guys are part of the SD. Mm -hmm. You guys have had a lot of fun this week, haven't you? Has Christmas camp been awesome? All right, go ahead, Leo. There you go. Let's just keep them interrupted. Yeah, yeah. Make the flow. Leo's in it. He's in it. Oh, he's oh, letting down. Good shot. Oh, he's letting down. He's good letting shot. down. All right, here we go. You can do it, Leo. Everybody, cheer for Leo. Help him get it in there. Help him get it in there. Nice strong shot. Help him get it in there. This is a rivalry that is going to carry on for years. Forever. 
Christmas camps to come. Quinn going for the final arrow, hoping to move forward. strong shot. All right, Leo, this is it. The chance for glory. Oh, yes. he's written Set. down again. He's written down again. He must be feeling it now. Last shot. I think Leo's showboating with the letting down. <laughs> I mean, a little bit. <laughs> So Stone, how awesome is Bro Staff SD Podcast? We have a winner. Oh, wait a minute. We have a winner. And the winner is... Quinn. Quinn Riles. Quinn Riles moves forward. Quinn Riles moves forward. How's it feel? It feels awesome. I love meeting you. How all those three shots feel? It feels great. Feels flow. Just flow. That's all. Just flow. He says, it's awesome. I love meeting Leo. It's awesome. It's just flow. It's just flow. Okay. Well, you know, Leo will have his day soon enough. And next up, Blaine Sands. Come on up, Blaine. Blaine in the oh, house. Blaine. <laughs> Blaine came to Christmas camp, set his bow up like brand new in the proper draw length. This is like a brand new fresh setup. He's like changed everything. And he has been a total trooper throughout this whole thing. And he has had to work his butt off. And I can't wait to see how much fun he has with this. All right, here we go. So George, he absolutely has been working all week. He's been working really hard. I understand that every now and though, though, when you're on the podium, according to your dad, you're not exactly sure what to do with your hands. Is that true, Blaine? So, so, so well, demonstrate like this for us. <laughs> <laughs> Let, let's see what we got here. So what do you normally do with your hands, Blaine, when you're talking to somebody? Let me just do it for you. Hey, Blaine, you're on the podium right now. So how do you feel like you've been shooting? I feel great. What's your hands? Do they, are they usually up here? He's doing it good now. Yeah. Yes, sir. He's, he's learning. He's, learning he's, from he's been mistakes. working on. <laughs> One other quick little on. fun fact about Blaine is that uh, even though he lives in Kentucky, he shoots often in Indiana. Oh. Beating out the Indiana boys for three state championships. Oh dear. Oh dear. All right, here we go. It is time for the match. Can Quinn get through Blaine or will Blaine move forward? Blaine, you will shoot the first arrow. going for it. Looking great. Been working on that form really hard. That was absolutely incredible, Chris. I 100% agree. 
you know, I was shooting next to Quinn, and he beat me in a couple Swedish dodge match just for fun during qualification. It was crazy. He can shoot. That's awesome. Blaine taking his second shot. Affected by the pressure. Cold yes. as steel. Blaine is bringing it today. I think Blaine just needed a little more pressure. I you think know, he just needed a little Sometimes something. you shoot better just he under just pressure. Like this. Something. Yep. Yeah. And the music is in his favor. Yeah, the music is totally loving him yeah. right now. Quinn Riles. Quinn going for it. Check. Was that in the middle? That, that, was, that, that, that was right. Was that was awesome. there. Wow. Bro wow. Snap. Yeah. Bro, Bro snap. snap. SD. Rowing down. Stone, you getting this content? He's getting this content. She did an amazing job. Keep an eye on our Facebook. I'll put that video up soon so you can see how that went. It was amazing. All right, Kirsten, it is your turn to shoot. Kirsten, have you had fun this week? What? Have you had fun this week? Yeah, I've had a lot of fun. I've learned a 
lot of new things that I've never learned before. What's the number one thing that you think you've learned at Christmas camp? I think I the most important thing that I've learned is that I need to hold my shot steady and not release pressure. Not release pressure. All right. Arrow number Keep one. That pressure. Pay attention to your tension, right? That's right. <laughs> Arrow number one, Kirsten Cotton. One shot at a time. DCR Media have done a fantastic job taking fantastic. care of this. Oh. USA we have, Archery we is have helping news. us by streaming this. We have news. We have so much great help. It's been amazing. Thank you, everyone, for what you've done to help us. All right, what is news. the news? This may shock everyone. Quinn is dethroned. Kirsten moves on. Whoa. No way. Whoa. No way. What? That just happened. How a did new the, Kirsten throne. Cotton what did is we the new miss? leader. Kirsten Cotton is the new leader. And next up, Woo! next up, Casey Thierren. You're up next. Let's go, Casey. Oh, let's do, another, let's do another little check. Everybody, let's yeah. hear it for Casey. I, I bet it's going to be more than let's 120, Casey, George. Everybody. Let's see. What's Kirsten's number? Hmm. 137. Woo! She's wow. a little excited. Feeling it. All yes. Right. Here we go. Judge Rhonda, you can start them off whenever you're ready. 
Casey, you'll shoot the first arrow. Solid first shot. Uh, Kirsten, before you shoot your shot, Chris, did you know yeah. a little fun fact about Casey is yeah. she picked up archery because she's really clumsy and doesn't think that she could do any other sport oh, very well. Oh, jeez. You know what? We That's... always have a running joke. If you can't make that bottle in the trash, better stick with archery. Better stick with <laughs> archery. Go with your strong points. Here we go. Kirsten Cotton, first arrow. Oh, yeah. absolutely great. Oh, right up in there. All right, Casey going for arrow number two. Smokes. Yeah, excellent shot, excellent. Woo. Kirsten Cotton going for arrow number two. Will she stay and continue on, or can she handle the nerves? Oh, she went down. Oh, 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 good good shot. shot. Oh, good shot. Oh, oh yes. here we go. Feeling you can it. do it. Feeling it. Deep breath. That's deep right. Breath. He. George, I just want to say, still just gave her a nod. Like, you know what? You, can you got this. this. You, you got this. You're part of the SD crew. Yeah, SD crew stays together. You mess with SD, you mess with all the SD. Oh! Nice oh, shot, Casey! Arrow number three, Casey Fierin. Here we go. Extra middle, if I ever seen an extra middle. That is cool. You can get an extra middle t shirt at Christmas. Oh my Christmas. god, we have another extra middle! Oh, extra middle! Let's go! It's tight. Extra middle. Extra middle. We're walking down. This is always so all suspenseful. Right, all right. Are we going to have a new champion? A new throne leader? Three. And she continues on, Kirsten Whoa! wins again! Show, show Kirsten, Kirsten the audience. Cotton. Did how that many was did incredible. Kirsten get? How many did Kirsten get? How many did Kirsten get? Two. Kirsten two. got two, Close Casey match. got one. I know that last arrow of Casey's was money. It was money. It was there wasn't nobody was getting good. that arrow. Yeah, that was a good one. All right, let's see who's next. Lucas Morgan! Ooh, Lucas yeah. Morgan! Lucas Morgan! All right, Lucas, take your place. Lucas is part of Bro Staff SD. Excel edition. Lucas is 13, but he's six feet tall, so he's at Bro Staff SD XL. <laughs> right, okay. Bro Staff XL. All right, here we go. Lucas, you'll shoot the first arrow. Kirsten's got to say about that. Yes! Oh, yes. We got some competition. Check. We got some competition. Things are heating up. Fair competitions a couple of years ago. That's a fun fact about Kirsten. All right. Kirsten with the second arrow. Oh! oh! Not 
Let him I'm here. I'm here with Lucas's dad, John. He's losing his mind. I'm losing my mind. I don't know what to do. I'm so proud of the boy. Oh, God, that's good. That was a tough shot. Dad says I'm proud, and he's at full draw. Oh, that was a good one. That was perfect. He needs that. All right, Kirsten, third arrow. Yes! Oh, Holy cow! Bro Staff SD is killing some exes. This is crazy. We're headed down you to guys, the target. You and Lucas came about all the way from the Reno. results. Yeah, we come from Reno. We shoot with wasting arrows there. It's a great club. We have a great time shooting archery. Yeah, and Lister Pitts, he's the leader of wasting arrows. Awesome coach. Y'all have a fantastic crew. George? We George, we have the news. We have a new leader, Lucas! Lucas! Lucas Morgan! Woo! Awesome work to both of you. Excellent shooter. That was an excellent run, Kirsten. Who is coming up Just next? Just kidding. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Hey, everybody. Who's up next? Stone! Stone! Stone Hendrickson, Bro Staff SD, going against Bro Staff SDXL. George, George. Here we go. Look how awesome that bow looks. Take a look. How hot is that bow? Yeah. Stone's bow awesome is brand bow. new. He's shooting a brand new bow. Just set it up. Why don't you tell us all about it, Stone? Um, it's a Prevail um, FX 3040 to so like 26. Um, XL sight, XL um, scope. Feather vision, AE, random bars, I love them. Gas bowstrings, ham ski, Jesse um, rest, um, brand new ultra view, drift. Are we, are we talking Colby Hanley? Yeah. Colby did, Hanley. You know, did you know Zach Harris is the CEO of that company? Yeah, have Bruce. You been, have you been hanging out with uh, Zach? Yep. So tell me what your favorite part of camp has been so far. Setting up my new bow, probably. Setting up your new bow, all right. He's been dying for that new bow. He has been dying. All right, Stone, you will shoot the first arrow. Here we go. Stone has been waiting for this moment all week. He has, he has. Winding up, settling in. Lucas's turn. Let's see what Lucas can do. Oh! oh my goodness. Lucas, this Lucas, how'd that shot amazing. Go? Uh, felt pretty good. Went off a little bit to the uh, left, but other than that, pretty good shot. How are your nerves right now? You nervous? A little bit, but I'm feeling pretty good. Scale to one to ten. Um, Eleven. Six. Six. Oh, this is nothing. Six. This is nothing. Wow. All right. Lucas. Oh, wait a minute. It's Stone's turn. To shoot. Stone's turn, yes. Yeah. It's all right. That went off high. It's all right. It's just one arrow. This is not a cumulative score. That's only one dot. Whoa, Lucas! Throw it down the heat. All right, Stone, this is it. Take that last one. Each arrow is its own competition. So one mistake doesn't kill you. There we go, that's a good one. All right, here we go. Lucas with the third arrow. Bro Staff XL. Yo! That was amazing. That was
was amazing. George, another fun fact. Stone also won state fair competition for doing arrow spine testing. Arrow spine testing. I'd like to see those studies. Yep. All right, we have All the right. results. What are the results, Chris? Lucas continues in the hot seat. Lucas is moving forward. This is amazing. These kids Incredible. have worked so hard this week. It makes me so happy to see them shoot so well under this kind of pressure. I mean, we've tested a few of them's heart rate with a little heart monitor, and their heart rates are 120 and better, and they're still shooting great shots in the X-ring. I just love it. In the words of Quinn Riles, straight flow. Straight flow. Straight flow. All right, let's see who's coming up next. Will Fowler! Will Fowler! Will Here he, he dethrone Lucas, or will he be eliminated? All right, Will, you'll shoot the first arrow. Oh, yeah! Awesome shot. Oh, yeah! The music uh, just Luke. stopped. Oh. oh, that would kill me. That would kill me. Oh, yeah, heartbeat. I love it. Oh, no problem. So, they're George, just, they're just trading tens. Both of these young men are 13 years old. Crushing it. At Crushing 13. it. Oh, oh wow. I still playing with Legos, and you know, right. I wasn't doing this. Yeah, uh -uh. Good. It's just like, I'm going to lose my boys. Luke, 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 let's, let's this is crazy. Let's heart rate monitor on you real quick. Let's see how we're doing. Will Fowler going for it. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Awesome shot. Awesome shot. Let's just say, uh, ladies and gentlemen, it's so off the charts, it won't even read right now. <laughs> Lucas has pegged the heart monitor. Let's see what he can do. Oh, oh yeah, that's a good one. All right, here we go. Let's go check. Let us know, Judge Rhonda, who will be moving forward. Will Fowler's from North Carolina. We've got a pretty big Hornet crew here from North Carolina. We got Eli Hughes. We got Brandon Durham. Blake Torrance was here earlier. We have a whole bunch of kids from North Carolina. I don't know what's in the water there, but whatever it is makes kids shoot bow, and they kill the X. I am so excited to see what this goes. And all of you guys that are high up on this list, are y'all paying attention here? Because this is hot. They are all coming. Right. George, They're George. coming to you. We have the results. We have the results. We have a new champion, Will Fowler. Will Fowler! Will Fowler's moving forward. Uh, George, have you noticed, there's very few shots that have been outside of that yellow. I don't even, I, wh wh why do they even have the blue out there? Is, uh, no, but nobody even needs to use it in this The group. blue is there just for decoration. Is it decoration? Yeah, okay. it creates a nice balance in between the red and the yellow. Got, yep, yeah. yep. Yeah. So who's next? Uh-oh. Timmy Smith. Yeah. Timmy Smith! Yeah. Timmy Smith! Yeah. Timmy Smith. Yeah. Timmy Smith. Yeah. Timmy Smith is from Every Arrow Counts in Morgan County, right? That's Morgan County? Matt. Well, they're in Madison, yeah. Danny, Danny Pincus is the coach of Every Arrow Counts. George actually plays the banjo. And Don't he you, shoots Timmy? a recurve. And he shoots a recurve. That's right. He he did most of camp either recurve or compound. He couldn't quite decide. Is Timmy good at banjo? 
I think he should play banjo for us. Oh, oh man. man! Holy cow! If, if if he plays banjo like he shoots his bow, he might be Earl Scruggs, Junior, Junior, Junior. Oh, we might have been feeling Will it a little bit on that one. That was one. a little bit low, but that's still there's room in there. Let's see what Timmy does with his last arrow. down to the targets. This is going to be a tight one, folks. It's going to be epic. I hope you guys are having fun. For those of you just tuning in, this is Christmas Camp 2018. Shoot down New Year's Day, the most epic way to start 2019. Hope you guys are enjoying it. The next person up. And we have George. George. Okay. Neusterson. We have a new hot seat. It's Timmy. Oh, Timmy. Timmy is up. The next archer that we have coming up, all the way from Yankton, Haley Johnston! Here we go. Timmy, all Timmy. All the way from Wendy Yankton. How's it feel to be on the hot seat right now? Well, Christmas camp's been an absolute blast, and everything here feels so real. And How's it feel? I just can't wait to see how it ends. Can't wait to see how it ends. That's how it feels. Awesome. You know, I was just thinking, that was perfect. That was your preloaded response, wasn't it? That was. Yes. Remember we talked about yes. that? Yes, we talked about preloaded yeah. responses. If you're nervous in front of the camera and you're not real sure what to say, just have something ready. And it was awesome. So that way you, you don't ever get caught. That was amazing. Yeah. A plus. A plus champion. Good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. George, so uh, Haley actually had three knee surgeries. Three. Oh, wow. Three. What have you been doing to so your knee? She, she decided at that point archery might be better for her than football. Yes. Yes. Yes, football and knees do not go together very well. Haley, Haley, you will shoot the first arrow. Okay, here we go. This is hard. Yes! There we yes. go. There we go. Oh, this is hard. I can see Haley holding on to that one. Go on, Haley. Shoot that bow. What have we right, been Timmy. saying all week? Let's see what we got. It's like blank veil against yellow. Oh, yeah. Awesome oh, job. There we go. Timmy is feeling the flow, bro. Everybody is doing so well. I just love it. Yeah! Oh my goodness! <laughs> there we go! There we go! Haley knows what's up! That's there we go! It. There oh, we go, Timmy! Oh, Not oh, backing man. down. Not you know what? I'm down. glad that I didn't even get my bow out this way. Oh. <laughs> I'm a little scared. <laughs> That was a little on the low side. There's some room in there for Timmy. Timmy can capitalize. Let's see if he can do it. Timmy! Oh, Timmy has got that one. Excellent yes. shooting, Haley. Good job. We're going to wait on the official results, but it looks like Timmy may get to continue. Let's take a look. Let's take a look. Oh! Alice Dukes is here, one of our valued, one of our valued volunteers here. Hello, Alice. Hello, George. How are you today? Are you having fun today? I'm having a great time today. Alice is one of our longtime Hornet moms. Her son grew up here in the program. 
and she's here with us, and Alice helps us with everything. The most amazing archery volunteer, ALC, part of a fantastic team. Thank you so much, Alice. This is my home away from home. Yes. Thank you, yes. Thank you Alice. Alice, you are uh, a charm. We have so the results, George. Banjo Timmy is continuing on. He banjo pushed Timmy. Banjo, 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 banjo Timmy. 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 Banjo Timmy. Banjo Timmy. This yes. is incredible. Did we just find a new nickname? I think we, we have did. Banjo, banjo Timmy. Banjo Timmy. I like the ring of that. Banjo I like it too. Timmy. What do you think? I think so. I mean, he's obviously able to play these strings just like the banjo. Yes, I believe yes. so. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. So uh, before we continue on for a minute, though, George, they're they're going to work on something. So this is the most successful Christmas camp you've had so far. I feel like this has been the most effective. Effective. The most successful and the most fun. Uh -huh. We've had such a great mix of shooters. We've got some new shooters. We have old time Hornets that have been part of the program for a long time. And they all just blended together, threw themselves into the exercises 100%. They shot amazing scores. They showed great improvement. I just can't say enough about how well that they have done this whole experience. I mean, they use every second and then more. Yes. Because camp ended at four. I don't think we got out of here before eight. No, no, they, yeah. would, they would just continue to stay on the target. Yeah. They're like, uh, no, I'm just gonna shoot another round. I Is it okay just, if I just shoot another round, guys? Oh yeah. Yeah, just one more, yeah, one, just more, one, more. And, just one, one more. more and. One more and. We finally so, just, everybody in the car. When we yeah. started out the week, we started very first day, we shoot a, we shoot a 60 arrow game as kind of a baseline. Last night, when we shot the 60 arrow qualification, how many kids said that it was their personal best? It was like 80%. Yeah. It was it like 80%. Like most they were of all the like, field, everybody was, I mean, yeah. a lot of the field, everybody was like, this is the best I've ever shot. Best, yeah. You know, we had six shooters above 590. Six shooters. Six above shooters above five. 590. That's stout. And that's yes. like the cut. Um, and, and that's like the so cut that everybody for knows that's on a world meeting. archery target. That's not the Vegas ten. That's a that's a that's a solid. That's the little. That's ten. the little ten. Yeah. That's straight flow. Yeah. Straight flow. All right. All right. Let's see who do we have next going up against Banjo Timmy. Oh, I love that name, Banjo Timmy. <laughs> we have a seasoned Hornet veteran coming up. Hannah Moose! Hannah Moose, everybody! Dominating the ASA. Here she comes. Hannah has been shooting ASA. She's been shooting OPA. She shot Lancaster. She's been everywhere this year. She's ready to throw down, and Banjo Timmy's going to try his best, but Hannah gets to shoot her first arrow. Go ahead, Hannah. Let's go. Excellent start to that. Just a tad low. Timmy, can you capitalize on this? Oh my goodness! No backing down. Pedal to the floor. Hannah Moose, she's got one just a little bit. There's a little bit of an opening there for Timmy. Oh, oh that's going to be That's going to be tough. This is a tight Timmy test. Timmy did not capitalize on that arrow. That one's going to be tough. The uh, judge is going to have to check that. Hannah needs this one. There it is. There it is. She executed on that. She knew she needed it. Timmy needs this one too. These are all so close. Oh my goodness. This is going to be close, folks. We might have to check my pulse. I'm, I'm feeling kind of kind of racy here. Well, moose George, like I can tell you this. Uh, our moose in Alaska don't shoot like that. Nope. Uh-uh. All right, headed down to the target. It's moose, this like moose is going to be Alaska a moose, close match. Right. All right, Chris, what do we got down there? Live down here at the targets, we have Hannah Moose versus Banjo Timmy, the new best banjo player in archery. 
It's Timmy. And Timmy continues, Banjo Timmy continues on. All right. That means we've got Timmy. We still got Timmy. Evan, who do we got next? Uh, good question, sir. Here you go. Here's okay, you can't read my sorry. chicken scratch. Yeah, nope, sorry. Uh oh. Uh oh. Colton Anderson! In the house! Colton Anderson, here we go. You know what? He doesn't say a whole lot. But man, is he intimidating. Just he look at that. He lets that bow do the talking. Jeez. Gonna let that bow talk. Rocking that new UV merch. All Colton, right. Colton, by the way, also plays the guitar. Really? So Whoa. it's banjo against the guitar right uh -oh. now. No. We need a duel. We but need a he's duel. Also... Anybody got a banjo? We need a guitar. We need a duel. Here's, here's what I've also heard. He's a professional deer watcher. He would like oh. to be a deer hunter, he but he's a professional the deer. deer watcher. A deer watcher takes a lot of skill and a lot of patience right. and determination. Right. Let me tell you Chris that. did some deer watching Chris, this Chris, year, too. Yeah, Chris, Chris yeah. doesn't do that. I love watching my deer. Yep. Let yeah. me tell you that. All right, Colton Anderson, you get to shoot the first arrow. Let's go. All right, everybody, let's hear it for Colton and Timmy. Who's gonna win? Oh, wow! Good. Oh, wow! Uh oh, oh, Timmy let down. Timmy let down. You might be feeling the pressure on this one. Shot to me. Oh, my goodness! Extra middle. Timmy going for the third arrow. Judge, I don't want to be the judge on this. Neither do all I. All of those arrows are going to be tough to call. Do you, need, do you need the heart the monitor for this? It is going to be awesome. Let's see who's coming up next. Nick, Nick Carteropoli. Hey, where is Nick? Carteropoli, where's my Carteropoli? Am I saying that right, Nick? Carteropoli, and do I have that? Nick, Carteropoli. Right? I got it! I said his name! Yes! George, George, we have the news! We have a new hot seat! It's Colton! Oh! Oh! Where's Colton? Colton's down there, shaking hands. The guitar wins. You know, I mean, I was really rooting for Banjo, or, uh, Banjo Timmy, but... Yeah, you know, I don't know. That's a lot of pressure. Oh, and no. he did great. Three rounds, right? Three or four? Yeah, he yeah. was amazing. Yeah. He was amazing. All right. Nick Carteropoli Mr. with a Sinka. brand spanking new bow just purchased at camp. Jack Clower, your old bow is back on the stage. That bow's got some bodies on it. It's won some matches. It's been through a shooter or two's hands. That actually used to be my old bow. Nick is about to bring it back to life with some tens. Here we go, Nick. Let's do it. There 
it is. All right. Bringing the Nick's heel. Nick's got one close to center. Let's see. Here we go. Colton Anderson. Oh, oh yeah. Oh. That's little a little bobble. high. Little bobble. Just eyeballing it from here. I think Nick has that first arrow. I think he does, too. This is going to be tight. Oh, oh, there's some room. There's some room. Colton may get. Colton may get this one. He needs it. There it oh, is. My goodness. There it is. All right, we got. It looks like one to this one. This arrow. This arrow is going to determine. This arrow all. is the deciding arrow. Will the old pressure. experience pro comp XL or will the new prevail move forward? Which one? Oh, oh, he laid down. Let him down. Oh, he knows I feel like this is the time to ask Colton a question. So, Col Colton, I see that you're shooting a torqueless dealer. Do you uh, do you find that it uh, makes it so that you shoot more in the center? Uh, yes, sir. It seems to shoot a lot better, and uh, it's a lot more consistent, and I like it a lot better. Excellent. Winding up for the last arrow of the match. All right, Nick Carteropoli, final arrow, and this one's going to decide the match. It must be a good one. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh. He did it. He did it. Putting the pressure on Colton. He did it, but there is room. That's not perfect. There is room. Oh, my oh. goodness. The judge. The judge is gonna have to get the magnifying glass out on this. Ladies one. and gentlemen, because he did that with the straightest shot. of faces. He was just like, yep. Is it on me? It's always on me. I feel honored. Anyways, we're back. This is a tight match. I'm not sure who wins. I'm gonna turn around and find out. And Colton continues on the hot seat. Whoa! Oh Colton made it! This is incredible. That final arrow, he knew that Ooh. all of it was on the line, and he executed. This is why this is so awesome. This is why you need to be at Christmas camp to experience something so incredible like this. I That was so tight, I couldn't tell. I was back here just looking. I thought that Nick might have made it, but man, this is gonna be great. All right, here we go. Where's he at? Where's my man at? Austin Wilcox. Where's Austin Wilcox? Austin. All the way from Michigan. Charlie, Charlie. Oh, Austin no, Wilcox. George. Austin uh, closely resembles Very closely. one of the most senior Hornets on our team, OG. Charlie Weinstein. Oh, gee. So much so, we've been calling him Charlie all week. <laughs> <laughs> hey, and. If he shoots as good as Charlie, he's got it made, and I think he can do it. So here we go. Oh, yeah. Austin, you shoot the first arrow. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, my goodness. Nerves of steel. Colton, going for the next arrow. Oh, there we go. This George is, is on it. George. This is going to be a show. Austin is a perfect example. We had to add two inches to his draw length this week. He went from 26 to 28. Oh, he let down. Oh, he let down. Good Feeling the pressure. Good you know, it's, it's good to be able to let down in a situation like this. However... In a I'm real head-to-head -head match, there's not a lot of room for letdowns. Not a lot of time. But we're learning here, so letdowns are permitted. Yes. There we go. Oh, there wow. we go. He is on Woo. fire. Yes. Oh, yeah. 
This nah. is going to be another tight one. I can hardly tell. I can't tell. I need my Also eyes interesting, it's Austin with an O. Evan with the lovely color commentary. Oh! That's what that's you call a, little low. a dip bang, folks. That's a little low. Pay attention to your tension. That'll take care of those dip bangs. Colton. Oh, oh my goodness. Well, Colton my. takes that one. It's a little outside, too, but I think Colton's got that one. Rondo, how's it Excellent feel to score work in such a both high of you. I can't situation. tell. I can't tell who has won it from here. Uh, we're just going to have to wait to see what Rhonda says. Awesome shooting, little high, definitely room for Colton to capitalize on this target. Oh, there it is, Colton's gonna take that one. He does it. Looks it. like one to one. Oh yeah. This is for all the marbles. There it is. Good shot. Awesome shot. Oh, Colton went down. He's, he needs this. this he is, knows this what's at stake at this yeah. arrow. This, this is, is it. This is a big one. There oh, it is! Oh my God! Colton took that one. Let's see how it goes. Good job, boys. Y'all go down there and check your arrows out. Hey, William. How'd that feel? It's pretty rough. Yeah, I can see it. I can see it. You're like buzzing right now. Do you love it? I do love it. Hey, let's do it. Go down and check your arrows out. What do we got here, William? Yeah, let's check him out while they're yeah, getting let's the arrows. Try that while you're going and getting the arrows. Right. Tell Chris what your number is. We have news. We have news. He is the quiet man. But Colton continues on. And we have oh, a runner right Anders. here. What are we at? Oh, my goodness. I can feel you shaking. Only 88. What? 88? Crazy. Only 88? She has good blood flow. She has good that's blood flow. Like, that's like when I get up in the morning. Right, yeah. <laughs> Holy cow. All right. So we had William Morrison. Now we got the other Morrison. It's Bradford Morrison. Here comes Bradford Morrison, everybody. Bradford. Man, they shot close together in qualifications then. 
Also, uh, George, did you know that uh, Bradford actually knows how to blow Twinkies up in the microwave? Oh my gosh. That is awesome. Bradford, you'll shoot first. white knuckling through the pressure. That could be exactly what it is. I think that's what that is. Some people just make it look cooler than we do. Yeah. Right? It just makes it look cool and, uh, yeah, just keep it buttoned down. That's right. Yeah. All right. Judge Ron and Chris are down there. What do we got, Chris? Man, this is tight. You know, Colton has such a good run, but this may have met his match. Uh-oh. All right. The first one is close. Second arrow, Colton. Third arrow, Bradford. All right. Do you want my opinion on this? Do we have a shoot off? It is Colton, he continues on. Colton Anderson takes it. Even it was so though, close. Even though the nerves were incredible, Colton still held it together. Cool, calm, and collective, just like Jesse Broadwater. I see it in his eyes. He's got it. Eyes for the prize. He's going to go all the way through the ranks and take this away. Baby Jesse. <laughs> all right. Who's next? Who is this? Who's this person that I have here? I have Kira Cook. Kira Cook. Fun fact Kira Cook. Kira Cook. Kira Cook shot her first ever 30 in competition yesterday. And she shot an amazing score. Judge Ronda's putting up some brand new targets. As soon as she gets out of the way, Kira, it's going to be your turn to shoot the first arrow. Are you ready to lead this off? I am. So how do you like camp? You came all the way from Alaska. How do you like it? Oh, it's totally great. I, I, I love it. It's I am so glad you're having a great time. I can't wait to see what you do next. Almost have the targets up, and we are just about ready. Colton's got that upper lip sweat going on. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Feel the burn, baby. 
George, I would say he needs a handkerchief, but he probably doesn't even know what that is. Yeah, he'll be up there dabbing like Luther Vandross. Just, <laughs> whoo! Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, Kira, tell us what bow you're shooting. I'm shooting the Hoyt Podium XUV 37. So, uh, how long have you been shooting that? Um, ever since it came out. I think three years, I think. Can you guys get a tight shot right in here by chance? Gaius, can you get right in here? Let me tell you, she's got this thing all blinged up. It looks awesome. Hey, you, you cannot hit anything unless your bow is matching, got some bling on it, got a little customizations, she's got some sparkle. It's all in there. All right, Kira, let's do it. Yeah. Let's hear it for Kira. Kira needs your support. I need some noise for Kira. That's what I'm talking about. That's it right there. Oh yeah, oh, there yeah. we go. There it is. Nine o'clock, edge of the yellow, Colton. Let's see what Colton's got. Kira's against a tough competitor here. Colton's, I know, it's crazy. Man, you look at that. Colton. <laughs> Look at her though, George, super calm. Yes! There's a 10 right shot. there for Kira. Colton oh, with yeah. another 10. Excellent performance. Colton! That looks like another hey, 10, just baby, at 12 o'clock. Kira, step over here for just a second. So, tell me something. Um, what's the best thing that you learned in camp this week? Um, my mental game. That's my mental game. Mental game. Well, you obviously showed some mental game right there. Good job. All right, we have me, Gaius. We have Gaius, the cameraman behind the camera, doing an excellent job. Knuckles, boom, there we go. Moving in, baby Jesse is doing incredible. Colton Anderson, let's go check it out. Who's moving on? Baby Jesse, I love it. We have a clean sweep, all little tens. Colton Anderson moving on. Colton Man, Anderson. Way. Let us know in Man. the comments below. Colton Anter Anderson is on a roll, and I would hate to be the next person that has to come up against Colton because he's all oh. he's all warmed up and ready to go. Oh, who is this? <laughs> who is this? Chris, Chris is hunting, buddy. Let's Chris go. is hunting, buddy. Austin Chamberlain. This? In his own custom designed hat, by the way. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I love it. I love it. All right, Austin. It's your turn. It's your time, Austin. Here we go. Can you do it? I think you can. What do you do? Dun, 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 dun. Whoa! Oh, baby. <laughs> Oh, that's man, that's one for Colton. Woo. So just a quick note, uh, these shooters, they haven't had any warm-ups. They haven't had any side ends. We just have a little blank bail where they can just shoot a couple of arrows. So they're jumping up here cold turkey. That's right. There it is. Oh, there wow. it is. 12 o'clock. Little hot. 12 o'clock, little hot. Ooh. My guess is, George, that half of them probably didn't sleep last night. <laughs> I know we didn't. It was about 4 o'clock in the morning when we finally wound down. <laughs> yup. There it is. Oh, Another man. one. 12 o'clock. Good shot. Oh, yeah. Yeah! Oh, yeah. 
to say, Austin, um, are your feet tired? Yeah. I think you're going to get to sit down. I know. <laughs> that was brutal. Okay, yeah, right. <laughs> With All the right, dad here we are. George just laying down those dad jokes. <laughs> here we go. We're down here with Austin Chamberlain right here. What's going on, Austin? So I just want to say something real quick. That is a perfect example of clicking your site after you know you made a good shot. All three of those were a little high. Did you notice that? A little bit. Did you move your site? A little bit. Not enough, obviously. <laughs> and there you go. Golden going all the way, baby Jesse. Two out of three. Baby winning. Incredible performance. Colton, I noticed that you're wearing an Ultraview hat. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And you know, we joke that Zach Harris is the CEO, but he really, what it means is he's the chief of everything other than what Kobe Hanley does. Yeah. Right? So he's yeah. in charge of everything. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Hiring, firing. You know, all of it. All of what's it. for lunch? So, yeah. so how do you feel after you've been shooting your grip for a while? Do you think it's making you like, I don't know, what is he ate up now? Um, it definitely helped my performance a lot. Um, I played around with just standard grips, and I just seem to come back to the view grip because it seems to shoot the best for me. So. Good job, good job. All right, next up, waiting in the wings, Hunter Longest. Hunter, Hunter's from the North Carolina crew. Rolls with Eli all the time. They're always down check here. Out, check out that bow. Check out that buckskin bow right here. Look, Look at here. him. What's your setup? I have a Hoyt Prevail 37, AAE micro diameter bars, uh, AAE Pro Blade, Shibuya Sight, Easton 2315, and uh, Stan Blackjack. And that's the combination to shoot extra middle right there. Let's see if he can do it. Oh my goodness, straight out of the gate, pedal to the floor, no stopping. There it is. Oh yeah, there it is. Point for point. Hunter has shown massive improvement, massive improvement over the last year. Oh yes. my goodness. Colton Anderson, second arrow. Bam, a little bit high. A little high, a little high. A little bit high. Colton drops a flick or two on it. Hunter coming in for the third arrow. I'm a, that I'm one's a, a little high too. Or high as well. I'm a firm believer in that twirl. And you see Colton's got that thing down. Yep. That's 10 horsepower to the shot. There it is! Colton is loving that bottom target. Colton is loving it. Let's see. Let me just check the list while we're waiting on the results here. Oh, oh. Ooh. Wait, y'all see who's next. This we're live? Good. We're live. We're on me. We're down here at the target with these two gentlemen. They're both so quiet, but they shoot so many middles. It's incredible. Let's check it out. What? What do we got? Every single one of them is really close. It's just they're that good. They're that good. Okay. George, do I oh do I gosh. hear what I think I hear? Do I smell a shoot off? Holy do we cow, smell George. a shoot off? I am not kidding. I think we have a one arrow shoot off. Single arrow shoot off. Shoot off. Shoot off. Shoot the first off. one of the day. Shoot it's off. The it's the first one of the day when we just can't decide a winner and big and have somebody who has clearly had some. We're going to shoot a single arrow, middle target, closest to center. This one is going to be tough. 
All right, Hunter, here we go. You're no first. pressure. No pressure. incredible this is going to be a good one let's wait and, and see george what do we got george colton has been dethroned hunter is our new hunter august hunter august has made it hunter. i know hunter. i know that hunter's grandpa eric is freaking out right freaking. now freaking out all right here we go colton what Who's a run next? buddy so now that you uh, almost won this thing what are you gonna do Disneyland? I don't know. <laughs> he needs a you sandwich or watch something. Some he looks a little shaky. <laughs> All right. Who we have next? Nathan Wilkins. Here we go. Nathan, first time at Christmas camp, showing some amazing improvement. Hunter is showing amazing improvement. I can't wait to see what happens here. This is going to be hot. Are y'all ready? I got I got to do a little interview here, George. Okay, let's do it. Nate, don't your <laughs> did you see bud. Him? Hey, hey, Evan, did you see him? He was like, oh, I'm going to oh, talk yeah. to me. He's like, dude, I'm oh. so ready to shoot. Yeah. I'm ready to shoot. Tell me about your equipment. Uh, so I got a Matthews TRX 38, uh, PS27, uh, the, the Jesse Ultra View Grip, um, Hamski Drop Away. Um, Eastern Contours, A E Ripper. Excellent. So tell me the best thing you've done in camp this week. Um, probably changing my form, making it better. Okay, let's see it. All right, Nathan is going to take the first shot. Here we go. There we go. Oh, there yeah. we go. Good. Now it's going. Now it's doing it. Here we go. Uh, that improving his form has maybe happened, Jordan. He's dead. Oh, that's oh. well blocked. Hunter's hitting a little high. A few adjustments made on the site. Pay attention to your tension. down. Why did you let down? Because uh, it didn't feel good. That's a great idea. That's a great idea. Uh, is this one going to be the one? Yeah. So tell me, what are you going to do right on this shot? The lack. That's an excellent idea. All right. Are you ready to try or you want to wait a second? Okay, you're ready. All right, let's go. All right, here we go. This shot's going to be extra middle. Hunter's going about 140 feet a minute here, I can feel. All right, Hunter, take a breath. All right, how are you going to do this one? Going in and just blow in the middle. You're 
Beats don't flow. That's right. All right, here we go. Good luck. All right, here we go. Hunter Longest, let's do it. There we go. That was a little low on the, on the outside. I think Nate's going to get that one. Here we go, Nate. Let's do it. It's a little high. There's some room. There's some room here, Hunter. Oh, that was a good look at Sean. Great shot. Wow. Hunter, that shot looked amazing. How'd you feel about that? That was really good. Yes, that's what we want. Rhonda, are you going to change the targets down there? All right. Hey, While Chris. Rhonda is changing the targets, I got a little something I need to do here. Chris, let you, me... Uh, while you're down there, could you explain Swedish Dot for the viewers at home? Swedish Dot? Yes. So, what a Swedish Dot match is, is it's mano e mano, shot versus shot. Top target, one person shoots, another person shoots. Whoever is close to the middle, they win that target. Move on to the next target, whoever wins. It's three points, best two out of three. You continue on. So, and if there's a tie, what we just experienced with a shoot off, which can happen, but it's a pretty awesome format and it moves through super quickly. Rhonda. Thank you, Chris. All Ooh. right, Chris. Yeah. Do we have results? We're checking in right now. Nick wins, and it's in the hot seat. Nate is the winner. All right, Nate. Nate. Rhonda has to change the target. So stand down here just for a second. I'm going to uh, present something here right quick. So step aside. I need Brianna Moore. Where is Brianna Moore? Yeah. Come on, Brianna Moore. Yes. Brianna Moore, stand right here. Look that way. Guess what I have? My gold pen? I have your gold pen. Hey everybody, Brianna Moore is now a gold Olympian. Oh. Justin from USA Archery, just in time. There you are, Brianna. Gold Olympian. From USA Archery. Look at that. Her gold Olympian pin. Great job, Brianna. Good job. What do you have to say? How long have you been trying for that? A really long time, like a couple of years. She did it! That's awesome. You did it! All right, good job, Brianna. Hey, Joy. All right, yes, fun fact Kevin. about Brianna. She plays the trumpet. Brianna plays the trumpet? She does. I didn't know yep. that. Absolutely. How did I not know that you play the trumpet, Brianna? I insist that you bring your trumpet and give us a show. Absolutely. And we need the banjo, and we need the guitar. The guitar. We're oh, getting yeah. the band back together, yeah. baby. Yeah. We're with the band. That's right. <laughs> All right, we got fresh targets up. Where'd my list go? There it is. All right, here we are. Nathan Wilkin is going against another camp first timer, Wyatt Harrington. Woo! Wyatt Harrington. Archery in New York. My good friend Mike Price runs Heritage Archery in New York. And Wyatt is one of the stars of Heritage Archery Joad. Mm -hmm. What's he going to be able to do with Nate? Let's see what happens. So, Nate, you came here from Colorado, is that right? Mm -hmm. So, tell me something. How long have you been shooting? Three years. Three years. Can you tell me how many titles that mean something to you? You have taken two. Which are what? What are those titles? Uh, he goes blank now. Yeah. He doesn't uh, even know. He told me earlier. He says, "Well, uh, Christmas Camp 2018. Uh, you right? Is that what you want? All right. All right. Hold on. Here it is. Outdoor." Target. National. Oh, 
Oh yeah, that's right, Outdoor Target Nationals, ladies and gentlemen. And you also broke the national record, is that correct? All right, continue competition. <laughs> All right, national record holder. Going against Wyatt Harrington. Wyatt, you get to shoot the first arrow. Let's go! Yes, you are. I am too, believe it or not. I'm nervous for you. Okay, are you gonna do it this time? Okay, don't maybe. We don't need maybe here. You need full set. We need intentional, 100%. Shoot it in there, don't hope for it to hit. Are you ready? You're gonna shoot it in? Yeah. Yes, all right. We need support, let's here go! Here we go, we need support, let's do it. his mom. She shared with us that he liked to hide in the dryer with his dog when he was in trouble. Uh oh! <laughs> Let me preface that with when he was little. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Wyatt, here we go. Evan, that was a little mean. <laughs> Not even fun facts from mom. And, and you're right, that was a little mean, but I will tell you that he's been shooting for less than three years and has taken the state championship for three spots, 2017 and 18. And Nathan, full draw. Yeah! Oh, oh yeah. I know that's his dot. That's the flow, right? He there. took that dot. That's his dot, y'all. He owns that root. Take some titles down there in the Iowa Pro-Am too, huh? Sounds like fun. We'll be there with you. Final arrow. This is for all the marbles. got to him on that one time. George, right. all I have to say about uh, that is archery. Archery happens. Archery happens. Sometimes yeah. that happens. Wyatt's going to get that last one for sure. Wyatt's going to get that last one for sure. Let's see. What do we got? This kind of threw a wild card. Hey, we got one. the BFG here. Hello, BFG. Hey, how you doing? So, uh, are you excited? A little bit, yeah. Yeah, you look like it. <laughs> Tell us what's new at Ultraview. Uh, he's a little quiet. He's got quiet. some new stuff coming. There's some new stuff coming from Ultraview. You don't know what it is yet, but it's going to be awesome. Do, do you have any teasers for us, Zach? Any teasers? It's all classified. 
All classified. classified. Same, same answer I got earlier this classified. week, by the way. All right, Chris, what do we got? Here we go. Nate wins. Nate right. moving in yes, there. That was close. Nate. The awesome thing about Swedish Dot, though, even though you have a flyer like that, it's every target is against itself. That's why that's awesome. And he continues on, even with that little hiccup. All right. Good job, Wyatt. Good job. Up next. Good job. Up next. I look forward to every time I get to say this. Release the Kraken! Oh, the Kraken! Oh. Caroline McCracken! Caroline McCracken is up next. Caroline qualified with a 582. Oh, that's Caroline. Hey, hey, George, did you know that Caroline's an avid artist? Yes, I did. She, yeah, computer drawing and paint. Yes. However, I did find out this week there's one thing that you don't do with Caroline. What do you not do with Caroline? You don't sing Sweet Caroline. Ba, ba, ba. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> All right, Caroline, you get to shoot the first arrow. Maybe Neil Diamond will be coming to your concert next. like the Marines, but where are you going to school now? Uh, I'm going to James Madison University. I'm a freshman there. Excellent. Uh, any other people other than yourself where your name's going to be on the wall here in the future, who else might have attended James Madison? Um, our lovely Rhonda has attended James Madison. And uh, I'm going to Brandon Gellantine and Jacob Wilkie. Jacob Wilkie. And Rob Cockle. Rob Founder of Lancaster Archers. Lancaster Archers. Yeah. Wow. JMU, long history. All right, Caroline. This is for JMU. Whoa! There it is, 12 o'clock, 10. Okay, Nate, I've got to do it to you too, though. Tell me something really fun that you learned this week that you're going to be working on when you get home. Um, like my release, like keeping it in a triangle. Here you go. All right. Now you can shoot that arrow. Here we go. He Final shot. Too much of a tip. Oh! 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 Caroline took that one. So Nate for Ooh. sure's got the middle. Caroline yeah. for sure got the bottom. And that top one is too close to tell. I can't tell from here, so let's see what happens. Chris, this is close. Let us know. I have let's a curveball on this one. I really thought it was going one way, and then, oh, it went the other way, and oh, it went back the other way. So let's find out. Nate continues on. Nate's got it. Oh, 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 Caroline, come here. Caroline, Caroline. Your vein was short, but it sure was awesome with that entrance. How's it feel? Oh, it feels awesome, especially how well their support and how crazy they are. This is awesome. Sure is. And we continue on. Moving on next, George. And next. who we have next? After Caroline McCracken, we have Austin Hall. All the way from Florida. Austin Hall. Do we have an Austin Hall 
fun fact. Actually, we do, George. Oh, yeah. Yes. Two days before indoor season, two days before Christmas, he actually broke his arm. And so indoor season was what we would call a challenge for him last year. Yes. Yeah. But he's got it all together. Got the bow stroking. He's ready to go. Austin, show us what you got. You get to shoot the first arrow. If you could, could you guys, could you guys zoom on on Chris for a second? I'd like him to do a jumping jack for us. A jumping jack? As a little warm-up. Yeah, do some warm-up. <laughs> do some warm-up. There you go, bud. Now go shoot your bow. <laughs> All right, Chris is in the wings, and we have the bear, Brandon Durham. Ready to bring it, Brandon. Shoot the first hey. arrow. George, you know what the fun fact about Brandon is? Eagle Scouts. We got Eagle Scouts all over the place. Uh -huh. Hey, everybody cheer really loud if you're an Eagle Scout. Woo! Everybody cheer really loud if you're an Eagle Scout. Woo! J.S. Carter, I don't hear you. <laughs> Zach Harris, you just have one little thing. We got Eagle Scouts everywhere. And we got Miss Alice. She's the eagle mom. Eagle scout yeah, mom. We got eagles all over the place up in here. All right, Brandon. Let's see what the bear has got. You gonna eat? Is the bear gonna eat? All right, here we go. I am the worst addict. I suffer many freaks. Oh! All right. Oh! Those arrows are almost 
identical. George, watch the end of Nate's stabilizer as he takes this shot. It doesn't hardly move. Oh, wow! That doesn't, doesn't hardly move. Mind. Clear your mind, Nate. Clear your mind. That's only one arrow. This is Swedish Doc. gonna eat today. You know, Colby Hammond says bear's the hardest thing in the woods to kill. It's a little high. Judge Ryan's going to go down there. I saw a little tiny fist pump from the bear over here. I saw a little tiny fist pump. Did you see that? I, there was, there I, was a little, I saw little that. Pump. I saw that. I think he's stoked. Mm -hmm. I think so. Did you notice Did you notice him vibrating? At I did. Drums? I noticed that. You can, you can see him feeling the burn. Feeling it. Yeah. I love this because they are just like in it 100%. Yeah. And it's like... This is worse than Vegas. They're in it to win it, for sure. This is worse than Vegas. Absolutely. All right. What do we got down there, Judge Rhonda? I better go down there, because Chris isn't here. Let's see what we got. What do we have? All right, Rhonda, what do we have here? Brandon with two. Brandon gets two dots. Brandon Durham, the bear, has taken out Nathan Wilkins. Hardest beast in the woods to kill, the bear. Who is Nate, next? Nice job. Who is next? Oh, it's Crispy. It's Crispy. Chris, Where's Crispy? Where's Crispy? It's Crispy. Crispy real. He's next. And all of you that have been hazed by the microphone, we're going to get Chris back right now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, Chris, <laughs> why don't you tell me what you're shooting here, sir? Well, I'm shooting Jordan Riles, 2315 Easton's. Thank you for letting me borrow them. I didn't bring any arrows. Chris forgot his arrows. <laughs> I didn't forget them. I didn't have room. I oh, like, look at this. I have Chris's what? mic. I can do oh, a mic. Whoa. Yeah. I also have my brand new sexy Hoyt Prevail. The Be Real Prevail with bright neon yellow strings, Hamsky Peep, True Ball XL products, and Shrewd and Hamsky. Shrewd and Hamsky. So um, I also noticed that you got a B on your grip. Also, Wanna tell me about that? Have the all new B real grip from All Tree Archery. Check that back. Look at me right shake. Ooh, I know you're shaking. Look at his hand shaking, y'all. This is a shoot-up. Look at his hand shaking. That's yeah. it. The B is shake? buzzing. Did the B is buzzing. Oh, yeah, yeah the I saw. Is buzzing. <laughs> the B is buzzing. <laughs> I'll, it's whatever. Alright. It's whatever. The bear gonna eat today. All right, Brandon. Chris is gonna shoot first. Is he gonna get stoned? Oh, Chris, the bear gonna eat.
All right, here we go. The bear going for it. I think the bee has stung the bear. I agree. Now, yep. it looks like we're going to lose a commentator. So, um, yeah. Carson right. Sapp. Carson, Carson Sapp is next. Yeah. Carson, I'm depending on you to whip Chris B so we can have his commentator right. back. All right. Here we go. The bear has been seated by the bee. Carson that Sapp. was an excellent run for the bear. And now, Vegas, so 900. So, Chris, Carson many Sapp. of you know. Both Carson. of these guys Fun are wearing. Fact, it was actually a 9-10 because he had a pass-through shot. Remember that? Oh, yeah, that's right. Oh, and one other little fun fact. Both of these guys have Vegas 900 club belt buckles. Chris has got his. Are you wearing yours? You just left room for your, for your new one, right? Yes. Excellent. All right. So real here we real go. Quick, Clash just, of the just Titans. a second here, Carson. So you know, Chris. Many people know him in the archery community for his archery stereotypes. I just want to know: Are you excited to be here? I'm pumped. Really? Where are we at? Like, 14. Snellville, Georgia, oh. near. <laughs> <laughs> We're in Snellville, Georgia. Chris, are you excited to be here? Because I know I'm excited to be here. I'm Jack. I'm very excited. You should be. Let's go. All right, Carson Sapp. Let's see what the B has got. Carson, let him have it. couple of years and you've got quite a team going. What's your guys' next uh, trip? Do you, know, do you remember what tournament you're going to next? Uh, we're shooting the Las Vegas shoot. The Las Vegas shoot, the collegiate division. Carson Sapp going for the third era. He's shooting for Mount Martin and Coach Joe's. Oh! Oh, Chris, be real. Chris, be real. Oh, yeah! Man. Wow! Stone, what do you think? What's going on, everyone? We're doing double jobs here. I'm just shooting bullseyes and commentating all at the same time. Carson! Oh, now the he's showing off. Pretty good. Oh, pretty good. I feel pretty good, too. I was shaking like no other. Yeah. Oh. You know what? One thing I want to point out streaming and all this video is made possible by DCR Media and 
USA Archery. Thank you so much. Thank you, everybody. Thank you. USA Archery and DCR Media for helping us bring this off. There is no Good. way that we can do this without their help. Thank you, USA Archery and DCR Media. This is amazing. I'm having a blast, and what a great way to kick off the new year. Am I right? Yes! Absolutely. All right, Chris, what do we got? Good. I'm continuing on! Woo! Woo! What? For real. What? No, uh, Did he real. say he's continuing I on? I think that's what he said. Oh. Hey, Chris, could you be real, please? I'm being as real as it can get. There you go. <laughs> All right, now let's see who's coming. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Chris be real. He's gonna have to work on Connor Sears. Connor, Connor Sears, we're depending on you. Connor, we are Connor. depending on you. We need our commentator back, which means you gotta put him down. Yeah, Don't get stung. So, Don't get stung by the bee. So Put him down. So, so Connor? Um, what are you, what's your next tournament? Uh, probably the World Cup Stage 3 and D, I guess. 20 days? 20 days. Oh, yeah. That's a good one. Uh, Chris. So, archery stereotypes has kind of revolutionized our archery industry, because guess what? We have less rage monsters on the range. Because once they become a rage monster, we just make fun of them. You're doing good work. So, because you're doing such good work, what's your next thing? Uh, B season. Season three is dropping today at afternoonish time. I'm trying to get it up by 5 p.m. So that's gonna be rolling out three times a week. It's epic. George, you had a sneak preview. He almost cried. It's amazing. I didn't almost cry. I was teary. Yeah. There are so many like real moments of like joy and hunting, friendship, yeah. and all that in the B season three. Mm -hmm. I can't wait to see the whole I'm thing. I'm Jack. I can't wait to roll it out. It's going to be awesome. I'll tell you what, it's crazy watching Chris work because he sits over in the corner with a laptop and headphones on, and you know what's coming out of that laptop is you, amazing. You can't even talk to him. He's just oh, no. Like he's in the zone. Yeah, he's just like in the zone. But you know what? Uh, Connor Sears is going to help Chris gonna help him get back to his videos and he's gonna make sure <laughs> that that beat season gets uploaded on time because Connor ain't gonna get stung. So here we go, Connor. You get to shoot the first arrow and uh, do this up. Here we go. I think Chris is gonna hang on to that from now on. What's going on, everyone? <laughs> We're here live. That was that big. I was shaking. I was nervous. I don't know if you can tell, but my heart beats like 300 right now. <laughs> Evan, where's the heart monitor? I don't, I don't know, George. We, we gotta, gotta get that on one. Chris. Somebody's got it somewhere. We'll find it. The bee is buzzing. All right, they're checking it out. Connor won! 
Connor Sears has set down the beam. We get our commentator back. Connor, how does it Chris, feel? Chris, go get that beat season out for y'all. Especially to beat you, Chris. Oh, boy. Ooh, Ooh, what let's right. see. Let's hit a little button here. I didn't What's hear Chris what Chris at? Here comes his number. It's a lot of beats. 124. 124. Oh, 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 we're checking Connor now, too. Here it comes. It, oh, yeah. He beep, 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 beep. Here it comes. Slowly but surely, he just blinked it out, ladies and gentlemen. Let me tell you, I think he's a little excited. He's shaking so hard at Walmart. 146, George. 146. 146. Wow. Yes. All right. All the way from ALC Team Sweden, Prince. Marcus Alfler, here we go! Four two. Four two. All right. Marcus is going against Connor Sears. Marcus yesterday shot an unofficial Swedish junior record <laughs> yesterday. A day of personal best, and Marcus threw down. So here we go, Marcus. So, uh, fun fact about Marcus there, George, is that he played soccer for five years before he got into archery. Were you good at it? No. You were not good at it. But you stayed with it for five years. Yeah. Yes, he stayed <laughs> with it for five years. He wanted to make sure. He wanted to make sure. All right, Marcus, it's all yours. You can shoot the first arrow. gonna get it. He's gonna do it. Let us know what's going on. I have the update shortly. This is going to be tight. We're getting into the very intense matches. This it's, is insane. It's coming. We're up into. We got one more person that is not in the 590s. Whoa. We're and not even in the 590s. We got all the 590 shooters are going to lock horns. Take a look at this list here. 
Look at all those 590s, 594, 592, 592, 591, 590, 590. George, this is going to be tough. All right, Chris, we have we the update. We have a new hot seat. It's Marcus. Oh, Marcus. Marcus from ALC Sweden. Here we are. Next up, all the way from North Carolina, Eli Hughes. Eli. Unofficial, Eli unofficial Hughes. basement arm wrestling champion of the world. Oh, so George. Yes, you know, here in the feats of strength portion of Christmas camp, that's where everybody like the little wrestling matches break out and arm wrestling matches and stuff. Um, oh, yeah. I kind of was just sitting there quietly and waited on someone to beat everybody in the room and then just walked up there and slammed them down. <laughs> we were all like, whoa! So I have video. I'll be putting that up on Instagram here shortly. Fun, on the fun fact about All right. Eli. Fun fact. He restored a 1972 F100 Ford truck. And it is gorgeous. And he painted his coffee cup to match the truck. Really? That's, That's cute. gorgeous too. All right, Eli. Here we go. You get to shoot the first arrow. You didn't want it there low. No, no, no. Scale to one to ten, how nervous are you? Like six, seven. Oh, that's not, not too bad. Say like 57. I was like <laughs> 22, but you know, is what it is. All right, head it down now. Oh, we already have the results. Eli? No way. Eli Hughes. Eli Hughes. Eli Hughes is unseated Marcus. And now we're up into the 590s. And the first 590 to go against Eli is Baby Giraffe. Gaius Carter! Gaius Carter has a 37 inch draw. 30. The Baby Giraffe is going for it. He's gonna try to beat Eli Hughes. Now, don't let the scale of what's going on, uh, you know, mess you up. Just to let you know, Eli is a 30 inch draw. Right, so now do the sun. Oh, wait a minute, 30 and a half, he says. Okay, it's 30 and a half. Now, now take a look at the difference in scale between and then, Gaius and Eli. I'm 28 and a half, so you know, what's up? That's what's yeah. up. Yeah, all right, Gaius, it's all rap. you, baby. Let's 
Let's see what Eli can do. Where we got? Oh, Gaius took that one. It's one to one. We're down to the last arrow again. Ooh, that was all the way in. That was all the way in. Oh! He let go. Okay, Eli, you know what to do. <laughs> Stop. Tell us what you're going to do. Keep hard pressure on the back wall and let it rip. That's right. Let it rip. A close match, super tough. I was even in his face trying to mess him up and make it harder. Man, that was a good shot. I don't even want to have to try to do that myself. I'm gonna leave my bow put away. Chris, what do we got? George, that, that's crazy. That's really that crazy. That was crazy. Yeah. Eli took what, second in 2017 in Lancaster? Yes, he did. Second. All right, George, we just have new news. Gaius is the new hot seat. He dethroned Eli. Oh! So that final arrow was not enough. Not enough. The G Raph. G Raph. Gaius, I'm on my tippy toes. He's gonna hold me while we do this interview. <laughs> How was it? It was pretty good. Uh, it's shaking all over this point. So you just gotta believe in what's gonna happen and let it rip. Let her rip. Ladies and Full gentlemen, time. he really is let me holding down. Chris B up. All right, here we got, coming up, going against Baby Giraffe. We got another giraffe. We got the BFG, the big B. friendly giant. F. Rude. Zach Harris. Yes, his real name is Zach Harris, but because we have several Zachs that work for uh, Ultraview, um, we had to call him Bruce. 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 Yeah, so he got a new name against his will. Yeah, it's actually his middle name. His, his other name. nickname is actually Nick. Nick. As well. But he graduated from the name yes. Nick. And the original Hornet, Zach, is now Nick. <laughs> yes, that name was transferred. Yep. Jack Sh Zach Shreve is now Nick. Oh. All right, Mr. BFG. You have the floor. Zach, dead center. Oh, they has got a good answer. Those arrows are in almost the same position. You're doing a fantastic job, and this year it's going to be your first trip to where? Neem. You're going to Neem. Hey, everybody, all y'all folks in France and everybody that's coming, Zach gets to come with us. We're going to have a blast. Are you ready for that? Yeah, I've been ready all year. You've been ready all year. And, George, uh, look has Zach been working on his French? Know, I'm excited. Has he been working on his French? He has not been working on his French. Not even one lick. We really need work. French fries. Not fry. even one lick. Pizza. All right, here we go. What do you got for your last arrow? Woo! 12 o'clock 10. Baby G Raph gonna try to take it.
Oh! oh that was going to be tough to call. I do not want to beat Judge Rhonda because she has really got to work on that. That's going to be a tough one. So, George, one thing that we need to work on here at the ALC is teaching the kids the French words for extra metal. What is that? Uh, I don't know what that is. I Caroline, 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 you've been working on your French. Where's Caroline McCracken? There she is. What's the words for extra middle? Can you like put that together for us? No. No, no. no right. it's actually in Spanish, it's also no. PJ Deloche, said Pino, if you guys are out there, help us out. We need the no. words for extra middle. Extra middle in French. We'll teach them to Zach and Caroline. What do we got? All right, George. The G Rap continues on. Gaius Carter is Gaius done. Carter continues on. And let's see. What do we got? What do we got? Who's next? Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh. Matthew Russell. Matthew Russell is also a bear. Big old bear. Big old teddy bear. I think bears can eat giraffes. What do you think? I think so. They might need a trampoline to bounce above them, but. Yeah, they just gotta jump. Yeah, you gotta climb up right. them. Yeah. yeah, yeah. All right. All right, Matthew Russell, it's your time. Let's shoot some tens. Oh yeah, that's the Lay it down. Oh yeah, looks like Matthew Russell might have took that one. sandwiches this morning and you helped us put all this stuff in the room yeah I did thank you so much all of you gay us you've been running the camera you helped set up too thank you Spe speaking of which George I just heard that you need to take him out because they need their camera guy back so oh all right yeah yeah, yeah I yeah. forgot about that you yeah, need yeah. to meet him okay yeah, here meet we go him. meet him all right Matthew I'm not sure what the outcome is going to be, but I just want to tell you that I'm very proud of you. <laughs> All right, here we go. Trees, this is a close one. Rhonda, what do you think? All right, we're looking. You guys, just a pro tip. Oh. If you hit them all in the middle, there's no question I'm looking at this. <laughs> How's it feel right now, Matt? Uh, not gonna lie, I'm a little nervous. Uh, I think, I think I somebody needs to go to one to ten. How nervous are you? From Five. Yes. Pretty chill. Merch. BeRealMerch.com. George, we have a new hot seat. It's Matthew. Oh! We get our cameraman back. We get our cameraman 
back, yes. Matthew Cameraman Russell. Cameraman back in action. We were wondering if bears could eat giraffes. I think we just figured it out. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh uh -oh. boy. Is that Tyler. Tyler Heritage is here. I hope he has his. Tyler uh, Heritage is here. You hear the floor shaking? That's him rocking in. He has his preloaded. Tyler Heritage. Here we go. Tyler Heritage been on the stage at Lancaster. Matthew Russell shot a 29 X at Lancaster last year. Both of these guys are very familiar with this situation. Let's see what happens. George, um, Tyler actually mentioned to me that uh, that he's working on his interview skills. We have been so working on let's Tyler's go interview and skills. That. Okay. So, Tyler, what did you have for breakfast? I don't like Chick-fil-A. You had Chick-fil-A? Okay. What was it that you had there? Uh, I had number one sandwich. We woke up at like 11 30, so it wasn't really breakfast. It was like coffee. So, so uh, are you a little nervous? Yeah. Did you warm up a little bit in there? Yeah, three ends of blank bill. Three ends of blank bill, okay. So what kind of equipment are you shooting? Uh, Hoyt Prevail, uh, Cabal Cell Sight. Um, oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> yes! It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. This okay. Moral is support. Camp Moral is support. all about. Moral support. Yeah. Um, AMC, um, Hybrid Pro Rest. Um, oh, two mics. Um, Easton Arrows. Three mics. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, oh my gosh. <laughs> uh, so Tyler, this is truly what camp is all about. Yes. It is about building you guys up, getting ready for you for these kind of situations. And this is awesome. Yeah. So, what was the best thing you learned in camp? My mental game. Uh, <laughs> you can't touch my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> that, oh yes, we can. <laughs> We're right up there in there. Yeah. But mental game, uh, like believing myself, believing the shots, trusting the bow. And it hits when I trust my shots. Excellent. Awesome. So, random work, interesting fact. You did fact. a good job. It's yes. Great work. Bye. Yes, random interesting fact is he actually likes to be the guy that tells people random interesting facts. Oh, wow. Yes. Really? Yeah. yeah. So, and, and he says that they right. usually mean nothing. But, okay. You know, mean you one go. random interesting fact. I can't really. Oh, now he can. Yeah. Oh. oh. Random interesting fact, Tyler. Um, I like shooting bow. Oh my gosh. Uh, okay, we're gonna let you right. go. Is that a go-to? That was a go-to <laughs> answer, bro. That was excellent work anyway. You did a good job, Tyler. Good you job. You are getting better every day. Yes. That's what it's about here at Hornet Camp. Better every day. All right, here we go. Tyler, it's your time. Here we go. And Matthew continues on in the hall. Oh, Matthew Russell. Matthew. Matthew Russell. 
Matthew, Matthew, Matthew. Matthew, Matthew Rose. Rose. How's it feel? How's it Matthew feel to continue Rose. on? Oh, it feels great. I love it. You love this? You live for this? Oh, yeah. All the time. All the time. He lives for this moment. All right, George, who do we got next? Who do we have next? Who do we have next? Hey, Carson, who do we have next? Cooper French? What is Cooper significant French? about Cooper French to you? What? Did he beat your record? Oh, yeah, he beat my national record. How do you feel about that? I feel pretty good. New world record for the cadet man. Whoop, whoop! All right, everybody, Cooper French! Cooper French in the house! So, George, fun fact about Cooper French, he's actually a twin. No way. And his sister does not shoot bows. What? That's not right. You know? She needs to right. Every, everybody Check needs to have their name. Let's get a zoom in on his shirt right here. Rocking that B-roll first oh, swag. Be real. Thank you so much. Rocking that B-roll first swag. Chris awesome. is such a commercial. Oh, he's really good at it. <laughs> no, hey, yeah. hey, hey, hey. If I'm going to commentate, we need a little spice in it. <laughs> All right, Cooper French, the moment is yours. Chris should have made his shirts a different color, though, so he could shine them, shine them with a Sharpie. <laughs> Silver Sharpie. Silver would be White okay. White paint pen. Oh, there it is! That was right up in there. Oh, Matthew Russell, Matthew Russell, right in there. you have for breakfast? I had Chick-fil-A, actually. Chick-fil-A. Chick -fil that was popular this morning. These Chick-fil-A made some money off of this camp. Dude, because Chick -fil -A. I'm telling you right now, they have torn up some Chick-fil-A. I will tell you, it does not hurt Chick-fil-A that it's only a, like less than a half a mile from the, uh, the Archery Learning Center in Snellville, Georgia. Cooper French, final arrow. This is for all. Oh, there it is. Good go. shot. Six o'clock. There's plenty of room for a win there. Oh, he did it. That was too, too, too close middle. to call from down here. He did it. It is too close to call from down here. Too close. Too this close. is going to be a, this is a tough Cooper, match. Cooper, what's your excitement level right now? How hype are you? Scale to one to ten. I'm probably on like a 12 right now. Super hype, um, kind of shaking a little bit, but so far so good. So awesome. Cool, it's cute. Oh, kind of shaking a little bit. Master. You know what I hear, George? I think we should check his heart rate. I think it's a heart rate monitor time. Here we go. This is close. We have a clean sweep from Matthew. Continuing on. This is incredible. Nice. He is Did you see that sportsmanship there, George? Ever there was some really good sportsmanship. Did you see 
you that, Chris? I did. You gave him a hug and everything. Everyone's hugging, everyone's shaking hands. We're all friends, even though we want that title. That's so right. But, you know, it's still a The fiercest a good time. competitive friends we've ever known. That's right. Oh, Matthew. Being all that you right. Won that one, Chris is going to take your little pulse rate to see where we're at. He's shaking, but he's not that bad. Let's check it out. Uh, Rhonda, can we change the targets out on Oh, you're one? shaking. 143. Jeez. That is a fast heart rate. 143. All right, so we're going to change the targets button? out. You feeling it? And while we're working on changing targets, guess what, everybody? This is the final match. This final. is the finals. This we have match. coming up on the stage. Known 50, Shooter of the Year, Brady Hampton. Brady Hampton! Yeah. All right, Brady, how many awesome games did you shoot during camp? I shot a lot of games. I don't really know how many. But... How many 30Xs did you shoot? So two 30Xs and a lot of 29, 28. You have torn it up. Did you drop any points? No, sir. Not yet. Not any points. You're going to Vegas, right? Yes, I can't wait to see what happens. Matthew's going to Vegas. And you're going to do well too, aren't you? Yes. So here we go. Rhonda's changing the targets out. This is the final match. We're going to continue this as a Swedish shot instead of shooting 15 arrows because this is working so well. So the winner of this will be the 2018 Christmas Camp Final Exam Champion. So one of the things that George said this week is that archery is a performance art. And guess what? Guess what our fun fact is? What? Why don't you tell us? I've been doing martial arts since I was eight years old. And that's about it. So archery and martial art, performance art. That helps. Can you say that the lessons that you learned while practicing martial arts, have they helped your mental game in archery? A lot of things that happen in martial arts over my mental archery. Yeah, I've noticed that too with like sports like golf too. Yeah, um, it helps my mental game stay tough, stay strong, and go all the way to the end. I'm excited. I can't wait to see what happens. All right. Are we ready? Hey, we're ready. We're ready Are you to ready? rock and roll! Are you ready? Are you ready? Yeah! Yeah! Archery Lady Center Christmas Scam Final Shootout Brady Hampton against Matthew Russell. Matthew 
Ronnie Russell, Christmas Camp. He doesn't even know what to say. He loves it so much. All right, let's get down here and check it out with George. George, how awesome is that? That was so awesome. What a great match. They were hammering the ten. It's incredible. Matthew Russell, step up here in the light. You have done it. And here is your award, Christmas Camp 2018 Champion. And let's hear it for Matthew Russell, everybody. Woo! So here it is, Woo! Christmas Camp 2018. What an awesome camp. Matthew, what do you got to say? I can't believe it. You can't believe it. Why can't you believe it? I don't know. I didn't hear last year. Uh, I didn't hear 300, but I wasn't anywhere close to like the first. I had no clue that I would be standing up right now. You've done it. All that hard work. All that hard work. You had to blank that. You had to shoot targets at close range. You had to do the wall bash. And just like a year and a half ago, you're like, ah. Oh, this work and I'm just it's not coming it came it did <laughs> yes it did everybody thank you so much. thanks so much for DCR Media USA Archery thanks to all the Hornets and all of our visitors thank you Facebook YouTube Chris B thank you everyone this was epic Evan Scott Rhonda, Judge Rhonda, there she Rhonda. is. Rhonda! Come on over here, Judge Rhonda. Yes. Rhonda works behind the scenes. All of our Joad parents is keeping everybody fed. Thanks, everybody. We'll see you next Christmas camp. Woo!